Hey, Mike. What up, girl? We're somewhat working, but it's going to be fun. It's been about an hour. Yeah. <laughs> we gave my dog like four treats. She pretty much ate all of them. And then she's probably going to come running in here a second, even though she's been uh, an angel while we're doing it. But anyways, we have a beer from Treehouse Brewing. This is January Julius. It is a two and a half percent version of Julius. They're actually, they actually call it American Crusher Ale. I didn't know what that means. It was canned on one four. Today is two, no, today is two two. Right? Oh good, look, there she is. It is February 2nd, yes. I don't know how to, I don't know that's, we'll see. We will see. One thing we will see, Sean, is that this is your first beer in over a month. It is. I, no, it's a month. A month. It's a month to the day. All right. Because okay. I started on January third, and today's the today's the, today's the second. So I went I went a Friday to Friday. So it's four weeks. So this is your first beer in a month. Yeah. First beer with alcohol. I mean, uh, yeah. Listen, this beer, and then there's not beer. And my first beer is a two and a half percent <laughs> dry January. There beer we go. Tree, yes. So I mean. It looks like Julius, right? Yeah. It's sort of just like a golden yellow orange. It looks maybe a little thinner. A little thinner. A little thinner because you can see through a little more. But yeah, thinner, yeah, the head looks really good though. Yeah, I poured mine pretty aggressively. I got no head on mine. Oh, weird. Actually, might be a dirty glass. I just washed it. I know that's what you say, but I'm just saying. You watch me wash it. No. Uh, oh, anyways. Yeah. So, yeah, I mean, but it it, it looks the part is what it I'm does, saying, yeah. right? Finger ahead on mine. Big um, bubbles. Get a little bit of aggression going here. There we go. That's what I want to see. All right, uh, and, the, and the head itself is like it's just absolutely like like crystal, right? Yeah, it's gorgeous. Uh, yeah, it really is. Uh, I'm gonna get in those. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let me just knock everything over. Actually, I mean, yeah, it, it has it has some of those things you're looking for in Julius, right? It, it has yeah. the citrus, it has the peach, yeah. it has that 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 crackery kind of a yeah. malt thing going. It has the bubble gummy yeast thing, like the bubble gum, like. Yeah, this smells really good. It smells like it smells like something. It, listen, if I'm trying to be responsible, and I want something like Julius right now, it's giving me those vibes. We should find out though if it tastes like those vibes. Let's go. I say, I say, give me the vibes. <laughs> I'm not defending this yet. Cheers. Hmm. It's actually. Got a lot of berry, yeah. A little more bubble gum, but a little bit of water. It's definitely watery, but for what it is, like yeah. Um, but yeah, it's got berry notes. Don't you get that? Yeah. And it's more. It's more like Bazooka Joe bubble gum. I was just gonna say that. Hundred percent Bazooka Joe. This is yeah. For two hundred percent, it's really good. I would if they if, if they could somehow figure out to make this like non-alcoholic and still have this flavor profile. Yeah, it's good, but I would still drink the Sam. Uh, the Sam has so much more pineapple. Yeah. But, I mean, listen, I'm not mad at this. I would drink this. Yeah. If, I, if I was here on New Year's, like, you know, and, yeah, yeah. and like, hey, listen, I'm trying to take it easy. I'm not mad at you, Sean. I'll yeah, drink no. some of these. And I still have three more of these. So this is like a good, like, kind of mix it in with, with, with other beers if you don't want to, like, you know, pass it on your face. Um, It got a little bit of that. That sometimes we get with low EBV, really low EBV beers, a little bit of like a tea note as well, but not as much as a low EBV. Beer. No, it no, there. no. It is there, but you do get a little bit of it. Um, it reminds me just a touch of um, of those um, hop teas. It's just a little bit of it. Yeah, in there, yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the citron one, maybe. Let's see what they say here, though. It pours a light color. Yeah, with an appealing head. Yeah, yeah. carries notes of ripe mango, mixed tropical fruit, yeah. vibrant citrus. I buy that. Nothing else like it. I guess it's valid. At two and a half percent, it strikes the perfect balance between body flavor and drinkability while you hold strong on those New Year's resolutions with minimal alcohol and calories. Yeah, I think. I don't know about the body part though. No. Like the body part, like pretty thin. Yeah, pretty thin. But overall, yeah. yeah. If you're if you're looking for a lower ABV option and you're doing dryish January next year, pick this up. Would have been smart to do this in the beginning of January, but you know here we are. Yeah. Uh, you know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of just like almost like. And athletic, but with a little more flavor. Yeah, that's actually a good way to put it. Like, like there is like that. I think the burst of flavor with with the bazooka Joe and the citrus comes through uh, across the mid palate, and then it finishes off because like the very front of the can, like not can, the, the very front of the taste, there's not much going on, and then the mid palate kind of explodes yeah. with a little bit of flavor. Hundred percent, agreed. Well, anyways, 
down in the comments if you had January Julius, what do you think of it? What do you think of Treehouse in general? What do you think of this compared to the regular Julius lineup? I know it's quite hard to do, but um, don't forget to check out nerdsense.net. Like, comment, subscribe, and notification bell so you know if I post new videos. And I'm Sean. I'm Mike. And this, this is, is NerdSense. Nerd